Hey, what's up, ladies? Just wanted to come to you guys today to show you um, a few of the earrings that I've made. Um, a lot of people have been asking me questions, like sending me messages on Facebook or on uh, here on the YT, asking me if I was going to be doing the basketball-inspired earrings. And again, I'm still waiting on one of the shipments to come in. It's coming from Hong Kong, and my other shipment already came in, which was weird. It was from China, and it came in within two weeks. So I'm still waiting on this other package, which it has the majority of my stuff um, in it, like the hoops, the beads, um, I ordered more spacers. So I'm just waiting for it to come in. But out of the few little supplies that I did get, I'll go ahead and show you guys. Um, I didn't get a lot of my beads or a lot of my spacers because I ordered very few of them. Um, so the ones I'm going to show you today, like the beaded earrings and stuff, um, the reason why I only have a few beads on... Um, like ear hook or not ear hooks on the um, hoop is because I don't have all my supplies in yet so whatever anyway I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys real quick what they look like um, again this is this is kind of I guess just like a dry run of the earrings that I want to show you guys and hopefully you guys will be able to see them so these that's why they don't have ear hooks on them either because they're not for sale because I really just wanted to see um, you know how I was gonna lay out the earrings and stuff like that so that's why there's no earring hooks on them and they're just on like a little hoop that I made myself, okay? So that's what they look like. They're really pretty. These ones are gray. Yeah, I'm trying to get them. Okay, these ones are gray, like they're like gray marbleized beads and then the clear spacers. They're really pretty. I think they'd be really pretty. Um, these beads, the thing that sucks about those is that I didn't order these beads. I got these beads from um, my local, uh, like, um, what was it? Was it a rainbow or dots? But anyway, they were a bracelet. And I got them there. But they were like disco bracelets or whatever. So they were like clearance bracelets. And they only had like maybe six or seven of them left. But I bought two or three of the bracelets because they were only 99 cents. And then when I went back to get more of them, they were all sold out. So that sucks because these were like really pretty beads. So yeah, that's, <laughs> that's what they would have looked like though. So... I don't know. I ordered small and large hoops though, so maybe when I get the other hoops in, I'll just make little hoops um, that looks like these and sell them for those people who don't like the big hoop earrings. Um, then the next ones are the same thing. Um, these these were not these were the ones also that I got at the um, dots or whatever. These are the clear white ones. I'm sorry, there's so much light coming in. But these are the marbleized white ones with the spacer beads. Really pretty. I actually put the earring hooks on these ones. But they're cute. Like, they're really, really, really cute. So, that's those. And then these other ones. These are like, I don't know. These are beads. Um, these beads I got at the craft store. And then I put black beads, I added little black beads and spacers with them as well. So that's what they look like. Cute. Then I got, these are like grayish colored beads. Like gray. They're like a see-through gray, I don't know what they call it. But they're pretty, and that's what they look like. Sorry, I'm trying to position these guys so you guys can see the color, but it's not doing a very good job. But those were cute. Then I made these, and I don't know why I made these, because I just don't know why. These are with the green. They look turquoise on there, but they look they're green. And I got like a pull with them and then the spacers, the green spacers. And um these are kind of cute. I wore these the other day. I had a green shirt on. And um these green whatever you want to call them. Some people call them like I think they're called Pave or Pav beads, P A V E. Anybody who's searching for these type of beads 
you can totally, if you type in P-A-V-E beads, which is what some people call them. I don't know the actual name for them because people call them so much stuff. Um, you could actually Google these too. But I found these beads at Joanne Fabrics. And they were only a dollar. They were 99 cents. Um, these green ones. The big green ones, okay? I found these at Joanne Fabrics. And they were in the section where, like, the kids' beads are. Like, you know, the, like, for kids' beads that they used to make bracelets and stuff like that. That's the section that I found these in. They're just really small bags. And I think you get about maybe eight, six, or maybe six to ten beads in a bag. But they were 99 cents. And they come in... Um, they come in a mixture of colors. They come in green, pink, um, blue, white, purple. It's like four or five different colors. And then they got a bag that's just white. Actually, I'll show you guys those too. They have ones that are just white, like this. And I made a pair of earrings out of these. So, these are really cute. So, yeah. The white ones, they come in a bag all of on its own of like eight or ten of the white beads. And then they have ones, like they don't have just a bag of green ones or anything like that. Like they have the, they have a white bag and they have a mixed bag and that's it. But for 99 cents, you know, who cares? Like I picked up like eight or nine of these bags. I think actually I took all the ones that they had for the colored bags. So that was those. And then I made these just recently. I thought these were really cute. I wore these too. Oops. Maybe I'll show you and maybe I won't. There we go. Oh my gosh. <laughs> anyway. So here they are. I thought they were kind of cute. These are actually beads that I took off of a necklace. I got the necklace at the beauty supply store, I think for like $1.49 or $1.99. I took the beads off the necklace. It's like a baby blue, and I put the um, spacers on it, which I think is really pretty. And then I just added some chain. Really cute. But yeah, that's what those look like. And then I made another pair, and these beads I got at my local beauty supplies, or beauty supply store, what the heck? I got these at the um, craft store, the beads, and then I added some chain to them, and the beads are really pretty. It's like a turquoise blue and black. Those are hot though. I like these. And then I got a bead at the top here. So these are really, really cute. And then these are the other next pair that I, I love these earrings. I wore these out too. And I got so many compliments on them. Um, some of the stuff that I ordered, like I said, I did get in. And then some of the stuff I found um, locally, I found some of the stuff. These are just a pair of black. But they're not even really black. It's like a dark um, gray. The hoops are. And then I got these silver spacers right here. I got those at um, Joanne Fabrics. And then I got chain. And then I got the spikes. Because you guys know the spikes are really hot. So, yeah. I just put them on chain. And hopefully you guys can see that. There we go. And just put them on um, an earring. They're hot. So yeah, that's those that's what those look like. And then next, I'm gonna show you guys of course the big earrings, the ones that I just finished making. I actually have more that I want to show you guys, but these are the ones that are dry. So I went ahead and put earring hooks on them and everything. So these are the anchors, and these are um, gray, black, and white. So hopefully you guys can kind of see those. I don't know if you guys can see the color, but it's gray, black, and white. 
And again, you know, you guys keep asking me, where do you where do you get those? Where do you get those? Where do you get those? I get them from my local craft store. These are wooden pieces. All these are wooden pieces. The the puzzle pieces that I showed you guys, the swirl earrings that I showed you guys, they're all wooden pieces that you can buy at your local craft store. Okay, Joanne Fabric, Hobby Lobby, maybe even Michaels. I think um, you just have to look in the wood section, seriously. That's where I got these. I mean, they don't come painted. You have to paint them yourself, but these are wooden, so yeah. And then I did another pair. I think these are really hot, too. These are another pair that I made. Again, you get them at the craft store. These are horseshoes, and I just added some chain on them. And these are um, like a turquoise purple and white splatter paint. So, yeah, I put um, chains on those also. Real cute. So that's what those look like. These will be on my website soon. I haven't had a chance to because I guess I just finished making them today. So I haven't had a chance to put anything on my website um, yet. But I will be. And then I have one more pair, which I'm in love with these. And I think I'm going to keep these for myself. <laughs> I mean, I'm still going to put a picture on them if anybody wants to buy them. I'll put them on um, the website as well. But these actual ones, I think I'm going to keep my first for myself because these are so doggone cute. There's another pair of the anchor earrings. And these are um, like a turquoise blue and white and yellow like a yellow gold color and then I've got the um the turquoise chain and a gold chain and it goes like really well with the colors like I know you guys can't really see the color and I'm sorry but that's what it looks like it's really cute I love these earrings so yeah I'm definitely probably keeping these for myself but I will like I said I'll put them on my website so you guys can see them so anyway, that is all that I have for you guys today. Like I said, all the hoop earrings that you've seen, those were kind of just a dry run um, of what you know I, I'm, what my earrings are going to look like as far as the um, basketball inspired, you know, earrings look like. Because um, I don't want mine to look like everybody else's. So yeah, and these earrings I made myself too. These are the ribbon earrings. So I had to find something to match my shirt. So I was like, what the heck? So I found this ribbon. It's like a zebra print. It's like a turquoise and black zebra print. And then I used black um, ribbon on the other side. So these are real cute. But anyway, I don't have any of those up on my website yet. Because I haven't made a lot of them. I think I've only made like three pairs of the ribbon earrings. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much all I have for you guys today. Um, if you guys want to check out my link, like I said... Uh, to my website, I will put that down below in the description box. Also, um, I'm going to put, don't forget, you know, I have a, a few people ordering from me. Um, I don't know if you've seen um, my website from my Facebook or from my YouTube, but like I said, I have a 30% off sale going on, and you'll get an additional, um, well, like I said, you'll get 30% off if you put in Ms. Purdy, that's M I Z Z P U R D Y. Um, at checkout, if you put that code in, you'll get 30% off. So um, just keep that in mind. And um, yeah, that's pretty much all I have for you guys today. Um, I hope you guys had a blessed Sunday. And um, I'm going to be coming back to you guys again soon with another video um, once I get the other uh, earrings finished. So um, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to rate, subscribe, and comment. Thanks to all my subscribers who are leaving comments and everything. I really do appreciate it. And I think I'm going to start um, having some more contests, but I'm not going to do it through YouTube. I'm going to do it through my Facebook. And I'm also going to be holding, like, little giveaway sales. Or gi not giveaways, but I'm going to have little sales. And you can only know about these sales if you're on my Facebook. So make sure you add me on Facebook. I'll put my link below to that as well. I'm going to start doing, like, more normally, my puzzle piece earrings are $15. I might have a sale where I'm giving away a pair of the puzzle piece earrings for like $5 plus like $4 shipping. So you can get them for $9 instead of the $15. So 
you'll have to look out for that, excuse me. You'll have to look out for that on my Facebook. Make